say hi from Charish Math. Here is the question. PQRS is a trapezoid. With the stated side lengths in the diagram, find the area of this trapezoid. In the first step to solve the problem, I'm going to draw a line connecting from the point R to a point located in between the line PS. And this is the line which is parallel with the line PQ. I'm going to label here parallel. So this is at 17, same as the one with the length of PQ. Now, I'm going to look for this part. This is going to be same as the one located at the top here, which is at 16 units. And now, I'm going to make a second line. And this line that I have just made is perpendicular with this base PS. I'm going to label it as 90 degrees. And this is known as the height of this trapezoid that I label with H. I am going to do more labeling. For this part, I'm going to name it X. So for this part, this is going to be by using the entire length of 44 minus 16 here and minus the X. That is left for this part that I have just labeled. So it is going to be 28 minus x. I'm now trying to make h the subject for this triangle located on the right side here. That is by using the Pythagoras theorem. And this is how it goes. I'm now going to make another equation that focus on the h as the subject based on this triangle located on the left side. And that is the same thing by using the theorem again. And h is equal to the square root of 17 square minus x square. Since for these two equations located on the top part here are the same representing the height h. So I can equate it directly in this case. I can now use this newly equated equation to find for what is the value of x. I can offset the square root here. Expanding this equation, this is how it turns out. And next, rearranging. And the value of x that I'm getting here is 8. By substituting the value of the x into this equation, I am going to find for what is the value of the height here. That is going to be by using 17 square minus 8 square. And this value is going to be 15 for the height. To solve the problem here now is by using the formula of this trapezoid's area. That is by using 1 half multiply in the bracket the sum of 16 and 44, which is the length of the base and the top part here. And multiplied by the height here that I obtain it from this line, which is at 15. And the answer that I'm getting here is going to be 450 units square. I solved the puzzle here. Thanks for watching. And please subscribe.